Good afternoon, players. Merry Christmas Eve, Feliz Navidad, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Holiday Eve, whatever you say, honey. Happy and merry day to you. Now, let's get into this because I seen it last night, honey, but I fell asleep. Baby, why married to medicine star Dr. Jackie had to backpedal and pussy pop out of some comments she made years ago about black women and maternal health? Baby, child, it's re damn ridiculous and a hot boo boo shitty mess. If you don't know, Dr. Jackie is on the reality show Married to Medicine. She was also the breast doctor and several other celebrities out there in Atlanta. Now, I've seen the congregation of the internet streets run down on Dr. Jackie on other things related to some stuff that she said on Married to Medicine. But this right here was a little different. This was related to a podcast where she was speaking on the maternal health of black women. And it was really, really bad because we all know that the uh, maternal mortality weight rate for black women is the highest among all demographics. So she's speaking to this person and she says that black women pretend pain. That's the reason why they're not uh, heard whenever they're pregnant and they're complaining about things. Take a look at the clip. Sometimes as African-American women, we're a bit more dramatic and that you go to the doctor and you complain and you complain and you complain and you're not taken serious because you cried wolf the entire pregnancy. That ain't me, boo. I don't know what you're talking about, but go ahead. I didn't say you. I just said as as African American women, we want to also make sure you're being serious with your doctor and not playing the game so I can take you off work. Because then we see you 25 times in the pregnancy. It's hard to believe that there's a true problem when there's a true problem. I declare, honey, what a disgrace. Now, this is something that we've heard about black people as a whole for as long as I can remember, that we don't feel pain the same. You know, it was very reminiscent of what was said about us back in the slavery days, what she's saying there. And, you know, a lot of you know my story that I had my daughter at 25 weeks gestation. She was one pound and 11 ounces. I actually labored the entire weekend calling my doctor at least six times, telling them I was in pain, but they kept telling me that it was round ligament pain. Come to find out I was in labor, honey. By the time I made it to the hospital, I was two centimeters dilated. There was nothing they could do to stop it. And I had Deanna early because no one listened to me when I kept telling them I was in pain. Well, after this video surfaced, a lot of women in Atlanta who had seen Dr. Jackie for their births are coming out with their stories. And so this has caused Dr. Jackie to issue an apology on her Instagram stories, but I guess that wasn't enough. So she decided to make this video apology and I'm keeping a stack. It sounds like something from chat GPT. Y'all take a listen. Happy holidays to you and yours. I'm taking a much needed pause to address comments that I made in a 2020 live interview with one of my counselors. First and most importantly, to black women and mothers, including your friends, families, and the medical community who care for you. Because my words left you hurt and feeling unsupported, I want you to know I hear you, I see you, I believe you, and I apologize from the bottom of my heart. I am brokenhearted over this. The guilt and reality that I have hurt and offended people, especially black women, and some of my own patients pains me to my core. As I look back over the two hour video again and again, I admit that I used the wrong words and descriptions to properly convey my concerns regarding maternal mortality related to women of color. But the fact is we must do more because we are still dying more. If I could say it all over again, Here's how I'd say it. When experiencing a health matter, keep a log of your concerns and symptoms so that you can provide them accurately to your physician. Have a buddy system, someone who can advocate for you when you're with a physician, especially when pregnant. Know that a second and third opinion is not just sometimes warranted, but necessary. All right, players, so that is her apology. The congregation of the internet streets is not having it, honey. They said that it sounds like something from chat GPT. Now, just think, 
you know, the one person who you would think would be advocating for the maternal health of black women would be a black female OBGYN. That's who you would think. But just to even have it in your mind that she may be thinking this about you as you're complaining about your pain is absolutely troubling in my opinion. What I always tell people is to get a doula. I'm a trained doula myself. They will teach you how to advocate for yourself. They will be your voice when you are voiceless. And baby, they do a good job catching those babies. All right, players, put your thoughts in the comments. Let me know what you're thinking about Dr. Jackie, what she said in 2020, and her apology. Does it sound believable? What do you think? This is Double D Mama reporting for the Black Red News. Merry Christmas, everybody.